Welcome back. One final point before we go tonight. It's time for President Trump to clean house and drain the swamp like he promised. And here's how. First of all, the president should stop attacking Jeff Sessions. Attorney General Jeff Sessions has done more for Trump's agenda than any other person in the entire government. Jeff Sessions has fulfilled more of Trump's campaign promises than anybody else. He's gone after gangs, the violent MS-13 gang in particular. He's helped slow illegal border crossings, and he supported the idea of Trump's border wall, all in the first six months of Trump's presidency. No, Sessions hasn't gone after Hillary Clinton, which is troubling, but that does not take away from the good work he has done. Instead of attacking Sessions publicly, the president should go after Secretary of State Rex Tillerson. Tillerson's State Department is going rogue. The Tillerson State Department looks more like an arm of the Obama agenda, and it's Tillerson's fault some of Trump's key campaign promises are broken. President Trump promised to get rid of the Iran deal. Rex Tillerson and others convinced Trump to certify Iran's compliance instead. We all know that's not true. Iran has violated at least four provisions of the deal, including storing heavy water and operating advanced centrifuges, things they'd only do if they were pursuing nuclear weapons. Obviously, they are. Tillerson and his State Department, they don't seem to care. Meanwhile, Palestinian terrorists are attacking Israel because they want to wipe Israel off the face of the earth. The Palestinian Authority uses U.S. taxpayer money to pay the salaries of terrorists who kill Israelis and Americans. They refuse to stop the so-called pay-to-slay program that rewards violence, yet Tillerson's State Department said they can't pinpoint a motivation behind Palestinian terrorism, and Tillerson's State Department claims the Palestinian government rarely incites violence. Evidently, the Tillerson State Department is ignoring the Palestinian government-funded propaganda efforts aimed at encouraging Palestinians to attack Israel. The TV shows for kids that celebrate the blood of Israelis and the schools named after killers who murder innocent Jews. It's time for President Trump to clean house, and he should start by saying his famous two words to Rex Tillerson, you're fired. The president should also go after Congress if he needs to target somebody. Shame our representatives into repealing Obamacare especially Senators Susan Collins and Lisa Murkowski, who claim they're Republicans, but always team up with the Democrats and won't even debate Obamacare repeal. Clean house, fire Obama appointees in the executive branch, stop attacking Jeff Sessions, and instead fill open positions with conservatives. That's who the American people voted into office. We want a Republican agenda. We voted for President Trump to drain the swamp. Do it. And that's my final point tonight. You can reach me on Twitter at Liz underscore Wheeler. If you liked the show, please send me an email at oann.com slash contact. In the meantime, catch us here tomorrow at 9 p.m. Eastern. And until then, have a good night.